Crew Chief 36 here, and in this Microsoft Flight Sim video, I fly the F-15C Eagle in the Southern Carnic Alps from Aviano Air Base in Italy. I'm going to be pushing the absolute limits of this F-15, flying low under bridges, to carving tight meandering canyons towering over the rivers below. So stick around and enjoy the Eagle screaming around the Italian countryside. Alright, let's go and uh, start this Eagle up here. Go and turn on our generators, our emergency backup generator, and then our engine master switches on, one and two, and our JFS. And then we will go ahead and uh, pull our JFS starter handle. Go ahead and bring the right engine over the horn. And uh, our percentage is climbing. We're getting hydro pressure. Make sure we get our oil pressure here. Looks like it's climbing. Yep, oil pressure's good. Looks like we're getting a good start. Go and uh, close our canopy. Once this engine is above 60%, we'll go and uh, pull the JFS starter one more time and we will bring the left throttle above the horn. Alright, we're at 60. Go and uh, pull the JFS starter one more time and uh, move the left throttle up. Our RPM's rising. So is our hydro pressure, uh, making sure our oil pressure starts coming as well. All right, oil pressure's coming up. Everything's rising up, looking good. Let's make sure we turn our inlet ramps on to auto, and then uh, we'll go and uh, throw our taxi lights on and our. Landing lights on before we forget. All of our anti collision and position lights are already on. As you see, uh, I'm using the track R. Uh, we'll be uh, turning it on and off depending on uh, what we're doing. Uh, let's see here. Go ahead and make sure our waypoints are set up here. And then we'll bring our range. Uh, let's see here. We'll bring it down to. Down to 20. You can see you got a flight path going here, so we don't get too far off track. All right, looks like we got a good start here. Go and uh, take a park brake off. Throw our nose or steering into high, and uh, let's conduct our throttles together. And we'll taxi out of here. Brake check good. We got double rainbow action going on over there, nice. So this is a free airport off of uh, flysim.to, Aviano Air Base. It's uh, pretty well, all the houses are well modeled. It's definitely awesome that we have these uh, awesome handcrafted airports that we're able to download for free on PC. Approaching our ILS line here on runway 05. Looks clear. Go and get out on the runway. line up here and we'll get on the brakes. You can see we're in a nose of steering high, we're going to bring that down to not high so that way uh, we don't veer off the, the runway too, too sharply. 
We're going to hold the brakes, get her to mill, release, and put her in burner. We're looking for a rotate speed around 140, 150. There's 150, and she wants to come up. And we're airborne, we'll go with low landing gear up. Take the flaps up and we'll get out of burner. Got some random storms around here. Hopefully, uh, we don't fly through a big one up in the canyons over there. That's where we're heading. We got a bridge, you know we're already doing it. We're doing 530 knots. All right, pull back to idle. We got some power lines here we're gonna stay low for. All right, we're gonna throw a speed brake out because it's gonna be a pretty abrupt left-hand turn here. Oh, that's a tight one. Dude's cruising a 400 knots here. It's cool seeing her shadow right there. Some insane canyons through here. Got a little big hard left here to get back on course. Oh yeah, that was sick. Transition into this next little canyon right here. So I noticed that about 95% of you guys watching aren't subscribed yet, so if you guys enjoy this content, go ahead and subscribe to see more awesome videos like this. Well, I'm pulling some G-forces on this one. Oh, a little stutter right at the wrong moment. Got a little sketchy through there. Open up in this big valley here. Still on flight path, looking good. Really big mountains up here. Dang, get some uh, serious stutters over here. All these trees probably trying to render. Close, huh? Oh, 
All right, we're going to make our way down the backside of the uh, Venita mountain range here toward uh, Lake Colazo. Pushing the limits of this uh, eagle here. Ooh, we got down to around 60 feet off the ground. Oh, we're at 50, 40. We'll throw speed brakes out a little bit here. Oh, I see a bridge. You know we're doing it. there. Oh, well, I see power lines. Make sure we stay below those. Ooh, that was close. Oh, more power lines. That was close. Almost didn't see those ones. Gotta love the power lines, that's uh, the We Love VFR um, download, also on flightsim.to. Really adds a lot. Oh man, I, I, there's no way that was so close. Might have uh, ingested a few uh, branches. Huh? Ah, let's burn the burner. Stretch our legs a little bit here. How are we doing on our flight plan? Yep, we're on path here. Got some power lines going right in front of us as well. Above the speed of sound, about 720 knots here. Definitely blowing some window windows out in some people's houses and all these poor businesses. 760 knots. I feel so good. We got 10,000 pounds. A little bit of rain over there. We'll power back just a tiny bit. Oh man, do you think we can do it? I think we can. Oh yeah, that was close. here. A little bit of rain here. Oh yeah, you can see the rain on the canopy. And uh, heading straight back to Aviano. Everybody should be off our nose here. The uh, F-15 is one of the few aircraft that can accelerate while going straight vertical. Man, look, look at 
clouds here. Yep, so those are all the mountain ranges we just carved through over there. And uh, that's where we entered right there. And if you look right there, that's Aviana right there. Swing down, fly down the active runway, get in a pattern. Yep, there's there's Aviano over there. So you know, like we typically do, typical runway pattern. We're going to be uh, approaching down the active runway, which is zero five. We'll be running down at eh, about twenty five, two thousand feet above the ground. Beautiful rainbows over there. Squirrel. And uh, we're at 500 knots, so let's put our speed brakes out a little bit, slow up. Oh, yeah, look at that rainbow. That's dope. About 1,500 feet altitude right now. So once we clear 250 knots, we're going to throw the landing gear down. So there's uh, 250, 248. Uh, we're going to throw the landing gear down and uh, first stage of flaps. Once we got uh, about 45 degrees behind us, we'll go ahead and turn left base. And we'll try to keep it around 170, and uh, we'll try to touch down around 140, 150, like most fighter jets. And uh, our A right there, that's our AOA. We're, we're, we're going to aim for around 9 degrees AOA as we're approaching, and then flare at the last minute. And uh, touch down with our mains and try to float the nose. A little bit of leg here flying through the rain. There's always limitations in this game, especially when you're trying to push the uh, 350 inch 4K screens. DLS sure is uh, magical what it can do. Alright, got the runway inside up there. Cruising about 179 knots. Try to roll out on center line here. 60. All right, we're gonna throw landing flaps in. Like I said, this thing's a little touchy. We're gonna trim out a little bit. And we're gonna try to put our fight director right on the black mark on the runway, about the thousand foot mark. Right there, 155 knots. Just hold this sight picture right here. Power, add a little bit of pitch. There's our nine degrees right there. Cruising about 148 knots. Now right, we're over threshold. We'll go to idle. Like I said, she's very twitchy. And we'll let her float in. And 
Chains are down. Use the big wings to air brake, and then we'll go and throw a speed brake out. And those will come down around 100 knots. And we are down. Some cool uh, static aircraft. To C-17 over there. I don't know about you guys, but that looked like a greaser to me. Uh, if you guys like, go ahead and uh, comment down below. Go ahead and rate my landing on a scale of 1 to 10. Alright, well, uh, don't mind me, I'm just flying this drone through the cargo bay of this C5 Galaxy to get the shot. <laughs> so, uh, I hope you enjoyed watching me fly the F-15C around Italy, so like if you did, subscribe if you haven't, and uh, come and be my virtual wingman. Later.